Was the glass of the front passenger side window of Frank Bonacci's Jeep broken from the inside out or the outside in? That is one of the main questions raised during Monday's testimony in the Jason Dominic homicide trial. Three Scranton crime scene investigators spent most of the day on the stand. Detectives Mike Fueschko and Dennis Lukasevich both testified they believed the window was smashed from the outside in, possibly by a tree branch, as it went over a 72-foot ravine in the area known as Step Falls behind the University of Scranton. That would directly contradict what Jason Dominic's lawyer says happened when Bonacci was killed. According to Dominic's attorney, Bernie Brown, his client's accomplice, Neil Powell, fired two shots at Bonacci, the first hitting the window, the second hitting Bonacci in the neck. The detectives also detailed blood evidence found in Bonacci's Jeep and testified about what they found in the garage of Dominic's friend, Neil Powell. Detective Fueschko testified that they found a total of 241 bullet holes in the wall of Powell's garage. Comparing it to a shooting range, the detective also says burnt clothing was found in a garage bay.